Still Want to Be a Mom is a book that will encourage, inspire, and guide you to motherhood regardless of where you are on your journey. It includes practical advice based on experience, instructions for appointments, tips on handling emotional triggers, mantras, journal topics, testimonials, devotionals, creative ways to pay for treatments, and even a chapter about how to relate to your man while trying to conceive, realizing that he's going through this journey and has emotions too. Have you heard the story about the dog and the elephant? The story is told about an elephant and a dog who both get pregnant at the same time. Three months down the line, the dog gave birth to six puppies. Six months later, the dog was pregnant again, and nine months on, it gave birth to another dozen puppies. This pattern continued. On about the 18th month, the dog approached the elephant questioning, are you sure you are pregnant? We became pregnant on the same date and yet I've given birth three times to over a dozen puppies and you are still pregnant. What is going on? The elephant replies, there is something I want you to understand. What I am carrying is not a puppy, but an elephant. I only give birth to one in two years. When my baby hits the ground, the earth feels it. When my baby crosses the road, human beings stop and watch in admiration. What I carry draws attention, so what I am carrying is mighty and great. So guess what? You too are an elephant. You are an elephant because just as this elephant had to watch the dog celebrate multiple births while she waited to have just one, you've witnessed family members, friends, co-workers, and even strangers announce pregnancies, deliver healthy babies, adopt babies, care for stepchildren, and ultimately become moms, all while you waited on the sidelines, fielding questions from people asking you, what is wrong? What is going on? When are you going to have a baby? Or when are you going to have another baby? In the story, the elephant did not give up simply because her process took longer than someone else's. She remained confident that her baby was significant enough to wait for and used the vision of one day being a mom to inspire her to keep going even in times when she wanted to quit. But how do you do that? How do you remain confident and keep going after you keep getting knocked down? Well, if you still want to be a mom after all you've been through, you will be and this book will show you how. One of the book reviewers from Amazon referred to I Still Want to Be a Mom as your silent sidekick that helps navigate through this arduous and lonely journey. If you still want to be a mom and need a personal sidekick, you can purchase I Still Want to Be a Mom on my website. It can also be found on Amazon and Barnes & Noble. If you desire an electronic copy, it is available for iBooks, Nook, and Kindle. And remember, if you still want to be a mom, you will be a mom.